Hey guys, so I'm back with another video. Um, I ran across something interesting. Uh, I had this uh, 500 Sportsman and she would fire up, it would idle, but once I uh, gave it some gas, it would die. Um, so I immediately went through everything. I thought uh, it was the timing or possibly the cam. So I took the cam out. The uh, cam looked pretty worn. So I replaced the cam. Uh, double check the timing and put it all back together turn out to do the same thing so then I went back through thought maybe it was the carb uh, you can see I got a different carb in there tried three different carburetors still the same thing it would start right up it would idle beautifully and as soon as I gave it gas it would die so after getting fed up I ripped the motor out, put a completely different engine in just to see if it would do the same thing. Only because I uh, got a couple laying around. And uh, same thing. So I'm going back, scratching my head. Um, and actually I had to replace, uh, I had to pull the engine anyway because the bottom motor mount was broken. So it was no big deal. And then, uh, so I went through the next step thinking, okay, well, maybe it's the... Everybody says to pull the black wire on the CDI box. So I did that. I got good spark. But same result. Um, so I talked to a couple people. I actually went and bought a new CDI box. And uh, put it in. And uh, it was one of those aftermarket ones off of eBay. Which was like 15 bucks. Plugged it in. Uh, watch the spark plug. It sparked for a little bit and then nothing. Um, immediately it uh, it died. So I knew a guy that had a couple uh, CDI boxes laying around. Put an actual Polaris CDI box in. And she fired right up. It idles fine. It revs up like it should. Uh, so I spent how many hours trying to figure this out along with replacing the engine. And uh, it turned out um, the CDI box, some people say, well, it's all or nothing. You know, it's either going to give you spark or it's not. Well, I found out that's not true because I used to believe the same thing. Uh, I was getting spark when I uh, hit the key. I even pulled the spark plug, uh, put the spark plug in the spark plug wire and touched it against ground. I uh, got spark, but uh, for some reason at higher RPMs, it just would not do what it was supposed to do. So uh, I thought I'd give you this little quick tip. Uh, it's a new one on me. You know, it took me to do a, replacing a lot of parts. Uh, fortunately for me, I've got a bunch of these uh, 500s laying around, so it didn't cost me a whole lot. Um, but uh, so if you're having uh, timing issues, um, you know, double check your, uh, your timing, check your cam, check your... Uh, uh, spacing between the uh, the lifters uh, make sure that's all good and you're having the same issues you know most people would say this would be a carb issue which you know I would have thought you know you give a gas it dies maybe it's sucking in air but yeah it turned out it was all electronic so uh, who knew uh, well except for a couple of players mechanics maybe but so I thought I'd share this little tip um, if you guys are scratching your head trying to figure out why you're uh, Polaris 500 uh, starts up fine, but when you give a gas, it dies. Check that CDI box. I uh, hope this video helped. Thanks for watching, and subscribe to my channel. I got uh, plenty of Polaris videos on there. Till next time.